Hello everyone, my name is Vlad A4 Galent Kabyukov Seroga And today we are shooting hide and seek But look at this location you guys This is a huge inflatable city We've collected all the inflatables that are in our city and created our own We built this thing to also use it in hide and seek We also have a hangar, our office, the area around us, a parking lot, a car, a roof you can hide anywhere but we will have unusual hide and seek today we will have camouflage hide and seek let me explain what this means we have a special person who does body art for us today this is a person who draws different drawings on the body and it looks very nice you know he can also draw you a t-shirt and it will be very 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 difficult for you to distinguish it from the real one we call him specifically so that each of us would become a chameleon and be able to merge with the location Here here, for example, is this location, yellow, blue, and red. I'll lay down, and the body artist is gonna paint on top of me. Red, blue, and yellow. And this is my camouflage. I'm gonna try to hide. He can paint us as a lawn, like asphalt, like a roof, like a brick wall, like the window, like anything. And of course, like our location. Guys, there will be two games today. In the first game, the three of you are looking for a suitable place for yourself. Tell the body artist about this place, and he will make you look exactly like it and I'll try to find all of you all three of you and the one I find last will win today a thousand dollars come here I'm sure yeah. I'm like a snake I'll hide you won't find me at all in general you guys you can already go and look for places for yourselves look at what you can merge with and then you guys you'll have to find me Ooh, <laughs> easy while I'm looking for you I will examine the location completely and I'll find the most 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 intimate place and merge with nature. That's it, you guys. The time has started. You have 10 minutes to find your location and then start looking like the location. Well, let's look around in this inflatable city. I'll try to find the most secluded place here because I'm small. I'll climb somewhere. I'll be painted quickly and that's it. Vlad will be looking for me forever. So what do we have here? Uh, not a bad place, but I think Vlad will jump in there and find me right away. We need to look outside somewhere. Or maybe disguise myself as a mole here. Although... There's a transparent grid here, he'll see me. Let's go see what's there. If I lie down here and they paint me, he may not notice me. So I'll take a note, let's see more. Hmm. And what if you hide not at the bottom, but climb higher? I think here, if you lie down, no, it's dangerous. You can fall from here at any moment. Uh, by all means, an inflatable city is fun. Lots of colors, big, easy to merge with. But I think Vlad will look for me here in the first place. Oh, I know another place where there's something bright. Let's go and see. So, uh, these things are too voluminous. I don't like that. I don't think that the body art guy can help me. So, when it comes to hide and seek, guys, I was actually the one who insisted that we shoot this new part of the hide and seek video because I love these videos so much. They're the most fun, the coolest, they have the brightest emotions, and it seems to me that only I like hide and seek. But if we get a lot of likes under this video, the boys will also like hide and seek too. And so, if we get a lot of likes, there's gonna be a new part and even cooler and more complicated and more interesting videos. That's it, guys. It seems to me that if we get two million likes, we can even fly to another country and shoot hide and seek. I don't know. We'll even fly to Santa Claus's village for the new year to shoot hide and seek there. In general, guys, be sure to like this video so that the guys understand that hide and seek is an awesome format. Prove that hide and seek is liked not only by me, but also by you guys and like this video. All right, I don't have much time left. I have to go look for a location. So, guys, well, first of all, I decided to go to our hangar because it's very big. And look, what we have left from the last video. A huge pool of water. Listen, there are interesting thoughts to hide right in this pool. Just dive in, lie down, lie in the water, the whole video here. The only thing that confuses me is how to breathe. Well, let's say we find a tube, but then I will break the rule of this video and they will not be able to make me look like water. I'm not a raccoon, so I'll have to look for another place to hide. So, can you make me look like this wall, like bricks? No, it's too risky. What if I hide in this closet? By the way, subscriber, you probably don't know what is in this closet, but you constantly see it in art videos. So, here's this constant supply of snacks from the A4 team. There's everything here, crackers, chips, Nutella, and so on. Maybe hide here? And Vlad in general, literally, will not think to open this door. 
No, Vlad will do that because he likes to eat all sorts of sweets. So this is not an option. So, okay, I'm taking a snack and gonna go look for a place where I can still hide. So this place is right behind you. This is Vlad's office. Okay, and hmm. Even though Vlad is not there, but it's still kind of creepy to come in. It says, don't disturb anyway. But here, right here in this corner, it will be a great disguise. There are two bright colors here and I will merge just perfectly. That's it, I'm turning into a chameleon. So, can you hide in any of these locations after all? Lie down and be like the red color, but it's uncomfortable here. The sun is very hot, so I'm likely to be able to lie down here for a long time. No, we need to look for another place. They're chasing me. No, it's too creepy here. I'll go further. Oh, a great location. I didn't expect it to be so soft. In principle, in theory, you can hide here, but if Vlad tries to jump in here the same way, he would just completely crush me. No, I won't hide here at all. So, a brick wall? Mm-mm, too risky. And if we draw white here for me? Mm-mm, not at all, it's all wrong. We need to find something interesting, something cool. We have an open warehouse. This is actually quite an unusual situation for A4 production. So we should try and find somewhere to hide here. We have so many interesting things here, guys. A whole A4 warehouse. You can't even imagine how much stuff there is in here. We have a bunch of different sneakers, some blasters. Oh, a modern fly killer from the video 24 hours on a cardboard boat. Bzzz. We have everything here after all. There's even this huge subscribe button. Look, it's here in the most prominent place so that you immediately go into the hangar and you see it, the red subscribe button. We need to solve the issue with it right away. Click on it and subscribe to the A4 channel. We're growing by leaps and bounds. This is very important to us. Subscribe to the channel, make the A4 family bigger, and we're gonna develop even more and invest more into the videos. And we're gonna need 800 warehouses to store all the things we have for filming. It all depends on your subscription. So, subscribe and subscribe. We even have some kind of stroller for the baby, but it seems to me that Kobe Cop brought it from home. Don't ask. Dudes, I think it'll be too noticeable here. It's all so colorful. I need to find something more monotonous. You know, interesting. Wait, monotonous, interesting, unusual. Wait, guys, what if I became a G Wagon? Guys, I think I'm a genius. I'm a G Wagon genius. I thought of something. I'm calling the body artist now. He's gonna draw me like a G Wagon. G Wagon is safe here. I know, Vlad. He'll just see that it's here, and that's it. And besides the G Wagon, I'll be here as well. So, to sum it up, everything's decided. I'll become a G Wagon. I've walked around the territory a little more, looked at where I could still hide here, and do you guys know what I realized? That all this looks like my first idea with the swimming pool. There is a dry pool with balls in which you can just jump in. Look like these balls. They would draw me like that, and I would lie here and chill in these soft balls. What a thrill. I've always loved it as a child. You can hide here. By the way, guys, we have a lot of trampolines here today. Write in the comments who likes to go to trampoline centers and swim in such dry pools. Write in the comments. I really liked it. I loved it. Well, that's it. The location has been determined. We're going to go get makeup done. Okay, so the artist is ready to draw me as a G-Wagon. I'm going to be standing right here, and they're going to turn me into a Glent Wagon. Also, look at what all the tools that the artist uses to create the body art. He has an air compressor. He has an airbrush. There's also sorts of little things here. I'm afraid to even touch them. I've never seen anything like it. Well, I've got this thing right here. Looks like tattoos. And the aqua makeup is also quickly washed off. This is a huge plus because we also have to film tomorrow. Therefore, we need to make sure that we can clean up before shooting. That's it. I'm already here waiting for my time. It feels like I'm getting tattooed all over my body. Are you also going to paint over my tattoo? Oh, that's it. It's gone. I feel cold. It's turning out pretty cool. I'm already about 50% G-Class and I really like it. Now is going to be a crucial moment. Now my, my face is going to be painted over. And only you guys are going to be able to see how it turned out because I can't look at my face. In general, I'm not sure how this is turning out. I want to know that this paint is water-based, it is safe, it's okay, don't worry. There's nothing to worry about. This is a special water-based makeup, like the kind they use in parks, only it's much cooler.
All right, subscribers. Do you think he can see me or no? It's just that you're running to look for someone, and here's Glenn like this. I think it turned out pretty cool. That's it, I am ready. Then they're gonna polish me a little more so that it's even more realistic. But guys, just check it out. I close my eyes, stand straight, watch. And that's it. Glenn's gone, Glenn's not here. Bam, Glenn is here. In short, I really like how it came out. I've already been photographed and shown how I look. It seems to me that the chances are about 50-50. It really depends on how closely Vlad is looking at all of the details. If he just goes to the office or the warehouse, I think he's gonna be very difficult for him to find me. I'm ready to get my makeup done. Look. I will stand here. You can see me now, but after a few moments, you won't recognize me at all. I'll be invisible. Oh, it's so unusual. There's so much pain on my face that I can barely move. My eyes barely open. But I really like the video. I can't wait to see how I look with this wall. I think it will take forever for Vlad to find us. Well, do you see me? I'm here. I think I blend perfectly with this wall. And when Vlad passes by, he won't notice me for sure. The main thing at this time is not to breathe. Okay, go, go, go. Don't get me out. Damn, while the boys were being painted, it became quite cold outside, but that still won't prevent me from winning today's battle. Now, I'm going to be painted like these balls here. I'm going to lay down there, actually. Let's get started. <laughs> My first impressions, it's very cold, but I'm determined to win, so I'll just put up with it and turn into a balloon man. cool it's turned out. Write in the comments what I look like now and whether it looks like boss. I sincerely believe that yes and I have a chance to win this game. Well, actually, that's how I look at the moment. I'm gonna climb in now. We'll try it. Maybe we'll fix something. Well, what will not be covered with paint will be filled up with balloons. The balls, by the way, are also cold. Cameraman, can you see me? Ha! <laughs> I told you it would be like that. Well, now I'm gonna lie here and wait actually until Vlad finds me. Guys, look, it's already slowly starting to get dark. Do you know where I've been all this time? I was drinking tea. I really like this filming. I don't even have a rough idea where the boys could be, but I have time to look for all of them. Let's go get right to the point, you guys, and start from the beginning, I guess. I don't seem to see anyone there. There's no one here. There's no one here either. And so I think that we'll go straight to the hangar. So, I heard that Vlad has already started looking. I just need to close my eyes, take a deep breath, exhale deeply, calm down, and just wait. I don't know how much longer I have to wait, but I'm already getting tired. Okay, okay, okay. You guys, I still have no idea what they look like at all, so I really need to look at everything carefully. Oh, no one? The ceiling, maybe? Is there anyone here? No, there's no one here. Let's go look higher to look at all of this from above. All right, let's go down. So, where are the people? So, someone had to hide here 100%, you guys. It was such a huge location. Well, it's logical. Well, did we deflate all this for nothing? Although you guys might have thought so and not use this location on purpose. Hmm. Okay, let's think some more. There doesn't seem to be anyone here. Let's move on. 
damn, I'm in shock now. He didn't find me. Can you imagine? He was so close to this pool. It seems to me that I found the first person. Let's go. Go on, go on. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> Galant, great! <sighs> well, what can I say? Probably due to the fact that the G-Class is very familiar to my eyes and I can even notice a speck of dust on it. But there is a clear distortion in colors. <laughs> 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 well, you could have probably come up with a better place. Well, why did you? Oh, G wagon. You could have started things from that side. I just thought you paid less attention to the G wagon because it's totally safe over well, here. Well, bro, I just turned my head and there's some colors here, so I thought, what happened? Who broke it? Smashed it? Scratched it? I noticed everything in this car, but here it's just an object, a glare, and everything's messed up. Oh, dang. Am I the first? Yeah. But what I want to tell you is, the quality of the work is excellent. But if you had stood on some new location that I'd seen for the first time, then I wouldn't have noticed it at all. Next time, I'm gonna think up a different idea. Well, Glint, I looked at the hangar, that zone, and now I'm moving over there. So I'm gonna go over to the office there. Is there someone there? I don't know. Well, you would hardly be hiding so close to each other. Did you paint my car as well? It's water-based paint. You haven't even seen what's happened to the Lambo yet. <laughs> all right. All right. Shelves, boards, a rope, someone's head. An alien? Damn, well this is hide and seek. Are they all wearing makeup? Yes? So hardly anyone is sitting in a box. Okay, this makes my job easier. Okay guys, let's go over to the office. The door is open on the lower floor. Okay, okay, okay. If someone is hiding in the office, it will be easy for me to find him because again, I've seen all these pictures again and in principle, I will see the differences. So let's go. All right, all right. We still have some repairs, don't look. White walls, nets. Okay, we'll go to this zone last. Now we'll go up here quickly. Let's move up, up the stairs. Listen, Sandy, tell me please, did someone go out on the roof? No? Thanks. Everything is clear here. <laughs> okay, let's go see what I have in my office. Oh, the door doesn't open. What? <laughs> Is it alive? Is it a sculpture? <laughs> oh, hello. Damn. <laughs> Look at Glint. <laughs> <laughs> Sergey also got caught. Guys, I'm telling you. In fact, it was necessary to shoot these hide and seeks in some other new location because I go in and I see a different object and I already know that this square is like the back of my hand. I have been on this planet since its very creation. I just want you to understand, I'm a G-Wagon. I'm a G-Wagon. Huh, oh, can finally exhale. I've been standing here for 40 minutes probably. People have walked around the office and didn't even notice me. How did you notice me so quickly? For a vision, you guys. So, is there anyone in here? Like no one. <laughs> I see no okay, we're moving on. So we need to go back. It seems to me that there are no people anywhere that I've been today. This is the corridor. We slowly begin to examine it here. So wait, Kirby Golf has already won a thousand dollars. What do you mean? Okay, but we need to still find him. So I'm looking both ways here. There's nobody here, there's nobody there. Cabinets empty. So we can't go in here anymore, so it's unlikely that the guys hid in here. Damn, you guys, that's it. And that's it. I've returned to the starting point and I looked at every centimeter, every meter around the entire hangar in general, and I can't find Kabyukov. I don't know. Do you know? Honestly, you don't know? I know. So I can't take you to help. Guys, that's it. I don't know where to look, honestly. I went through everything in a circle and I couldn't find him. I don't understand. I swear to you guys, I just swear. I don't understand where he could be. I can't see him at all. Ah! I get it. In short, I want to tell you, Kabyukov. Well, they just gave me a little hint because I walked around here and everyone laughed at me. Kabyukov, for the way, you've won. Seriously? Yeah, seriously. It looks like it. By colors, by shape, you passed by me three times. Yes, I am telling you, I wouldn't have stopped here at all. I went through the each place, looked into each one, and I looked at what it was like. Give me the money. Do you accept cards? I accept it. You will send it over. For real damn. I really like this place. It was super hard to notice you. Okay, guys, now you have to come and find me. 
me. You go relax, drink tea as I did, and then I'll get my makeup done and hide. Easy, no problem. Guys, I came up with a game inside a game. Let me go hide now and everyone will have time to come and find me. And the one who finds me the fastest, we'll get another $1,000. 500, 1,000, 500, 1,000, 500, zero. Okay, 500. That's it, I'm going to look for a place. That's it guys, it's time to go look for Vlad. It got a little dark, so this simplifies Vlad's task because it's much more difficult to search in the dark, but it seems to me that three of us can handle it. Each of us has five minutes, so who which one of us is gonna start looking for him first? Well then, you can start, you were the first one to be found. Okay, in short guys, it seems to me that Vlad is really sneaky and he could have hidden at the very beginning. No, he didn't hide here after all, but it would be nice to find him in a second. There's no one here. Vlad! Okay, there doesn't seem to be anyone here. I have two minutes left, and I don't know where he is. Maybe he's in my place. Maybe here? No, it's too smart for him. He would have guessed. So, well, like, no one squeaks, so he's not there. One minute left. Okay, the only place he can still be is on this mountain, but I'm not sure. So, what else do we have? I've looked at everything. Well, he definitely won't go there, 100%. 15 seconds and I don't know where to look for him. It's unlikely that he's here, but we need to try. Vlad, here, the G-Wagon has been damaged. Time's up. I've already managed to run like a lot. Guys, I didn't find him, but I have an idea that's gonna make the boys real happy. Well, Vlad, did you find him? I just wanna say one thing. I didn't earn the $500. Five minutes is a very short amount of time and you're gonna be stunned. Whoever goes next is gonna be lucky because at least it's a little bit visible because the last person is gonna be looking completely I'm coming. in the dark. I'm doing, I'm doing this, yep. All right then, Sergey, it's your turn. So, the inflatable city. I think Glenn has already checked everything, but just in case, I'll take a quick peek. Vlad, are you here? We're already finished playing. Doesn't answer. Oh, Lego wall. You know what? We gotta go to the G class. Not here. 30 seconds. So, somewhere around here, maybe near motorcycles. No, no. Oh, what? Awesome. Vlad, I was running fast, didn't notice you. Wow, this is awesome. Such cool disguise. That's it, you guys. Just hide the boys somewhere far away so that they don't even see a hint that I'm somewhere in this part. Guys, I want to look like the Legos. I'm going to stand here in this corner, cover myself as much as possible, and I'll leave only this much, and I hope that they don't find me at all. That's it, let's go. Come on, come on, come on, faster, faster, faster. I'll also put a white one here, right here. Look, look confusing with my hair. Well, you guys, who will be the first one to try and find me over here? So, it turns out $500 are mine? So, listen, you guys, uh, wait, we have another participant. What time do you have? 4.45. Listen, you're doing great. Well, how's it going? Guys, I'm going to upset you. I probably have $500 in my pocket. Yeah, I found him, but of course, I won't tell you where. So, how much time did it take you? 4.45, probably around mm -hmm. that. Yeah, so he's probably a little far from here. Go, go look, Kobe Cop. Hurry. So, by the time I started, let's go. Vlad, are you here? So, maybe here? No, he's not here either. So, I have now gone through all the trampolines, through all the slides, and he's not there. I have a very little time left, so I decided to run to the office. All right, let's go. Hmm, it's strange. There's no one at the office anymore. Vlad, I'm here. Come out. Hmm. He's not in the closet either. Maybe he's in his office. The lights is on. Hmm. No, well, he definitely couldn't hide here. Okay, he's in the office. So, we've exited the office, and I immediately had the G-Class and warehouse in front of my eyes, so I'll use binoculars. I can't see him there. I have another idea where I can check, where I didn't check when I was running past the lights. I'll show you now. And who is that that we have here? Hello? Well, how Are is you it? sure that you didn't have more than five minutes? No, no more. Exactly five. Y well, you found me. How do you like my makeup? Well, it could have been better. Like, for example, mine, but pretty good. Yeah, I just think you couldn't see me at all. I check on my phone, open the front carrier, and there's a Lego wall. All right, get out. You couldn't even do your legs? I thought that it would be faster because it was getting dark already. Okay, let's go to the boys. Guys, I have found him. 
And where have you been like that? In the Legos. In the Legos! <gasps> Look, over there! I was talking about this one! Copy Cup, turn on the light! So it doesn't work. Aw, oh, man. Let's go take a look. That's scary. Maybe we won't go. Man, guys, if it's in our hangar, we'll have to get inside anyway. Damn, guys. Uh-huh. Oh, it's creepy, but interesting. How did this stuff even get in here? Look, there are two options. Either it's A4 production or it's some kind of magic. Magic? Come on, if it's magic, we won't go. Please, guys. Why are you so scared, Kobikov? Don't be a coward. Are you subscribed to the channel? Subscribe. And you? Of course. And I'm also subscribed. And only the bravest are subscribed to the channel. Won't we prove it? Let's prove it. All right. By the way, I also have a suggestion for you. If you want to know if you're brave or not, try to subscribe to the channel. If it works out, Congratulations. And if it doesn't work out, well, how about visiting a gym, you know? Awesome. So, are you brave or not? Yes, I am brave. Well, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Look, this house is pretty small. No, it's like at a first glance. Get in, get in. Wow. Well, how is it? It's okay. Well, guys, time for an adventure. If you are with us, like it, and let's go. How is this even possible? Wow, this thing is so big and the outside is so small. How is that possible? Guys, take a look at these pictures in general. How can you sleep after this? Yeah, it reminds me of some kind of Dracula type of house. Check it out, they're also antique carpets. This house is 1,000 years old. Look at how creepy it is. Can we still get out of here? Oh, we can always leave. Why are you nervous? Let's go. No, I agree. Huh. There was a door right here just now. I don't get it. Well, that's it. We got caught. Boys, boys, well, I told you it's not worth coming here. There's always some kind of catch. Something is constantly happening. Quiet, quiet. Don't panic, guys. If the door is closed, then there should be a contraption that can open it back. Yes, nothing will happen. Okay, don't panic. Vlad, cool theory. Let's just pick up everything that is attached and look for some sort of mechanisms in here. Come on, try turning over the paintings, turn the lamps. There's nothing here. And this picture is nailed to the wall. Wow. And here nothing comes out. Well, it spins. Try again. It doesn't turn around like that anymore. Mm. What's in here? Ah! Oh! 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 Put it back. Put it back. What is it, guys? Nothing works. Come on, fix what you've done. Get on the floor, guys. Turn it off. Turn it on off. the floor. Where am I? Are you guys here? Vlad, come here, come! Oh, spider webs. What's happening? It seems like my hands are in place, but my body's also in place, and I'm all chained up in some sort of box here. I'm chained up. Oh, I gotta calm down. Maybe it's someone's prank. I feel with my feet that there's some space in front. We gotta try and go forward. Okay, slowly. Oh, dude, another box, another door. How many rooms is there gonna be? I hope this is just some sort of prank. <sighs> ah, what is it? I almost had a heart attack just now. Oh. oh, it's flour. I have dough in my mouth. Dude, what kind of jokes are these? What is this strange house? Vlad, Kobikov, can you hear me? What's happening? No, apparently no one hears me. I can't move back anymore. I guess there's no choice. We have to go forward. Oh. <gasps> Come down. No, there's nothing. Ah! There's spiders, flies, some kind of caterpillars! All right, okay, calm down. You gotta move on. I can't see you. It's okay, it's okay. No, there's nothing. It seems to have been swept through here, but it's still super scary. It would be better if they sprinkled me with flour again. Okay. Ah! I ate spider web! I can't stand it. Okay, let's go. It's a pity that my boys aren't here. They would... <sighs> you stupid web! Get the heck off of me! Oh, this is another room. How many more are there? Ah! Ah, how scary! Ah! I'm not going any further. That's it. Ah. Oh, 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 oh. It's finally over. What is this creepy place? Where are we? What kind of house is this? Oh, where are we? Oh, some kind of blood? Okay, come down. You gotta get out now. Vlad, is that you? Vlad? Vlad, is that you? Help me! I need help! I'm in the next room! Vlad! I'm coming!
coming to you! I just need to figure out how to get out of here! And there's those smelly worms and boxes! There's some sort of clock. It's written on the mirror. All shadows disappear at noon! And right now, it's only 6 p.m. Dang, and waiting here until tomorrow's not an option at all! Maybe I can just change the clock to noon. Okay. Ah! <sighs> What the heck was that? First, the mirror opened up, and then second, I'm probably starting to guess exactly what's going on here. All this is similar to some kind of horror quest, and you need to find a way out of any kind of quest. I hate these quests, but there's no choice. We have to go further. Oh, Vlad! Glenn, Glenn, Vlad, you're here! Glenn! Oh, thank goodness I found you! Help me! I woke up here in some kind of cocoon, and I can't get out at all! I can't move! My legs are numb! I also woke up in some sort of weird mechanism sprinkled with flour and with worms! Where's Kobe Cough? So untangle my hands! That's it! Ugh. Come out! Ugh. Who did this to me after all? I don't remember anything. Just passed out and ended up here. There's also a lot of children's toys and cobwebs in here. This house holds a lot more horrors than we thought. And where's Kobe Cuff? He's probably also in captivity. And what kind of chest is this? I don't know. I didn't even pay attention to it right away. Maybe there's some sort of tools that'll help us out of here. Let's find out. Come on. What, what is this? It's me. It's me. <laughs> That's so creepy. Your voodoo doll is here. And the suitcase is pretty small, not as it seemed at first. Really? Maybe there's some kind of passage and this is just a protection from above. Well, then how do we open it up? Maybe we should complete this puzzle. Okay, okay, Glance is already there. There are four gallows and we have four heroes on the channel too. <gasps> Maybe there are toys lying around. I found Kubica. Come on. Okay, this is done. Tiroga, he's loyal like a dog. Look what I've got! It was right under my feet! By the way, another red Kumi came up for Kobe Cup. Uh, and here's Siroga with glasses, and also a dog. Okay, so we remove these. Keep looking for Siroga and Kobe Cup. So, I found one. It's me again. Let's leave it here for now. Look for another toy. Oh, I found it! Kobe Cup! So, and then we hang the fourth without Siroga. Why am I here two times? I don't know, but it didn't work. <laughs> Glenn Kobikov, Glenn Vlad Paper. You're a genius, Glenn. So, Glenn Kobikov, Glenn Vlad Paper. It's lighting up. This is a real quest, but it's kind it's of kind deep, of deep here. here. I'm afraid to climb in. Me too. But wait, we're subscribed to the channel. And you remember that only the brave can subscribe to the channel. So we are brave. Yeah. We've passed this test already. I'm subscribed. Well, that's it. Get in. For subscribing to the channel. Nice. Okay, quiet, quiet. Ladder, a ladder. Uh, Give me you your hand. It. Give me your hand. Uh, I'll quiet, hold you. I'll quiet. hold you. Get in. Get oh. in. There's another step down there. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh, oh. Go. oh, oh. Okay. Okay. Come on, go on. on. I'm it. waiting. Oh, I'll follow I'm you. waiting. Hey, subscribers, have you passed the courage test? If yes, let us know in the comments. Let's see how many of you are there. Okay, so here I go. I hope we can do it. Go. Oh. Okay, keep moving. Oh. Oh. Where did we get to? This is some kind of creepy kitchen with black fruit? Well, if this is the kitchen, then we definitely find Kobe Cuff here. Huh. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? Whoa. Oh, 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 wait, easy, 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 easy. Hello, who are you? Oh, boys, you already arrived. All was with fine. The, the flight place wasn't a mess. No, no it's, fine. it's fine. Great, then. So, uh, uh, who are you? Oh, my boy, I'm Alfred, the butler. Hello, I'm Vlad. And, and where are we? What kind of house is this? And where's Kopikov? Oh, all the questions after dinner. Have a seat at the table, so, please. Uh, I please. don't really uh, want to eat. Please, please. I really... Come on, go. Uh, I don't want to eat. We're not hungry. No, have a seat, or dinner will get cold. Okay. Please? Listen, I have a question before we begin. Have you seen a boy just like that? He's fat with glasses? A boy? Uh, there was one. <gasps> Where is, Where is he? Sweet? Mm, Louise really didn't like him. She said he wasn't backed well. But don't worry, your dinner is cooked perfectly. Please? Your dinner. Ah! 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 Okay, I think that our food has been spoiled and rotten. I've got cockroaches on the plate. Mine has maggots in it. And anyway, 
Yeah, I don't want to eat it. Well, boys, you don't understand anything about real high cuisine. But dessert, by all means, try it. Today, it was an excellent success. By the way, I'll leave you with your dinner. I won't bother you. What's wrong with his face? I don't know, he's super creepy. And by the way, if that's enough for you, when the rest is in the refrigerator. Okay. Bon appetit. Thank you. I don't want to open it. Me too. And I don't want dessert, it's moving. Let's find out what's in there. Ah! Ah! Climbing ah! up. Ah! What's wrong with you? Why didn't you say anything? Guys, I don't know how I got here. I went in the room with you, and then, and then I woke up here. And now how do we get you out? I don't know. Look, Gobbicup had something in his apple. I'll get it out now. Maybe it's some kind of key. Damn, guys, I'm tied up inside. Help, please get me out of here. Quiet, quiet, quiet. Glenn, help him. Come on. I'll... Now I'm gonna help him. Call me, cop. Everything will be fine. Don't worry. Everything... Lift the table, guys, please. Help me, guys. Come on. Hurry up. Stay quiet. Come on. Hey, guys, come on. Please. Take off that it. stupid tablecloth. Check it out. There is a key here. Oof. So, okay. Guys, hurry up. Ah, there's some sort of lock. So where's your key? Let's try to open it up. Okay, hold on. There it is. This is your only hope. Well, open it already. Let's try it. It opened. And now? Yeah, it's open. Okay, copy, copy. <laughs> Help me. What are we waiting for? Will it work on this one? Nah, there's a code number. Four digits. Look for hints. He was talking about the refrigerator. There it is. Try it. Go to refrigerator and I'll inspect the plates. I'll go see. Refrigerator. The guy from the microwave said there was some kind of food here. Guys, the lock has been removed. And oh, open it. Wait, there's actually food. There it is. No screamers, luckily. We need to find the code quickly. Okay, we've got jars with jam with veggies. Take it. Oh, with jam. With jam is tasty. Jelly. Well, there's some jam here, too. Wait, there's no more jars. No, there are only four jars here. Four pieces. Um, four jars, four digits. Maybe the code is on the lid. Well, no. Then let's try to power the content into a saucepan. Wait. Oh. It's not the most pleasant content here. So you understand? These are worms. <laughs> oh, oh, come Guys, come. please, I can't stand it anymore. Oh, I see something. I see it. I see it. Oh. I'm taking it. <laughs> it says 27. Okay, open the next one. <laughs> <laughs> this is jelly. You can see through here. No, don't shake it. What are you doing? Guys, how long will you be there? Don't whine. There's no paper here. Maybe somewhere inside. There's nothing in this jar. Let's move on. Somehow I don't want to. We always have to save Kobe Cop from something. Oh, uh, uh, what is this? Oh, there, 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 there. Take it. 35, 27, 35, or 35, 27. Come on. Okay, where's the lid? Oh, okay. That's right. Let's put it back. 27, 35. Try that combination. Glad, help me. Yeah, be quiet, Kobe Cop. So 27 35 27 35 does it doesn't work try it vice versa 35 and 27 come on oh it worked take it off Woo! take it off another riddle solved guys as i understand it you need to follow the rules play the game fair do challenges think logically and it's gonna be fine yeah untangle yourself what are you saying i can't my hands are tied Hey, now you're asleep, just like my mom taught me. Ooh, thank you, guys. Do you even understand where we are and how do we get out of here? No. No, it looks like some sort of quest. We're in some kind of kitchen. We came from the stove. Climbing back is not an option. Well, then, we need to find a way out of here somewhere. There are two options here. Either to climb into the oven after that guy or some other closet. I want the closet. And me. Oh, it's just a bedside table. Let's go after the man. Kobe Cop, you're first. No, I'm not the first not one. Not me. <laughs> Glenn, come on. Look, there is some kind of blood inside the pot. Check it out. Yeah. What? What is this? <laughs> Tomato juice. <laughs> oh, trash. Well, Glenn, okay, go. I don't want to. Okay. Oh, it seems clear. Well, you're second. <laughs> wow. Man, you made it through. Kamikov, get over here. Oh. 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 The hands seem to be real. What is this right here? Some Monsters? Look closely, they have eyes. There's some kind of TV right here. Well, let's think logically. Oh, yeah, do you remember there's such a thing in Quest that you need to sit down and listen to the rules? Yeah. Sit down. So? Check this out, some rings. 
Hands like real ones, not plastic ones, with skin. Wow, what a quest design, that's good. Okay, we're setting, tell us the rules. But nothing is happening. Cassettes, cassettes. Our subscribers probably don't even know what this is. What? Subscribers know everything. I got it. For example, I watch cartoons on VHS tapes. Wow, I watched one cartoon, Shrek, more than a hundred times. And you? I've also seen Leopold the cat. Uh, it all makes sense now. So guys, let's get out of here as soon as possible. So, all right. Oh, you got a terrible house. Insert the cassette and then, oh, I get it. It's a rebus. That's a puzzle, yeah. Come here, stand up, help me. Your sneaker is fake. Insert it at the end if you're brave. Insert the cassette and the dead will flow out of the lake. Insert the cassette in, burn it. We need to find a word with a rhyme. Insert the tape in, put the tape in. Ah, look, we're being stupid. White, green, black, red. It's not here for no reason. It'll float out from the lake. Insert the cassette on the black one. Your sneaker is fake. Put it on the green. So, black, green, and if you're nice, put you're the brave, tape, put the whole on tape white. on white. I'm actually so bad at quests. You got into a scary house. Put the tape on red. I would never have guessed. Do you understand? In short, look, we need to put everything according to the context. Brave is white, fake is green, black is black, scary is red. Okay, sounds about right. Let's go back. Okay. Oh, it's on. Is that us? What is this? What is this? Some kind of ropes? We need to pull them. Come on, come on, you're first. Come on, copy cop, not me, no, not, not me. me. Copy cop, pull. All right, I hope no one jumps out. It. Let me try. Let. And me? Go. Oh. Go. Let. I'm so bad at these quests. It. You're our only hope, guys. Think about it. It. Let go. Ah, I get it. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. It doesn't work. And maybe we need to take turns pulling it. Come on, you're the first one. I'm pulling. Let. I'm the second. Let it. Let it go. Ooh. Guys, I'm so glad that I got into this quest with you. I wouldn't have guessed it myself. What, what is, is written it? there? Aren't you an A4 subscriber? Then wait, wait for, for us in your, your apartment. apartment. <sighs> it's good that I'm a subscriber. Me too, me too. I'm subscribed. I'm subscribed. And me too. What should we do next? <laughs> da -da -da -da. Look, this is our way out. Let's go. What are you so happy about? Yeah, come on. It's cool. Let's go. Nothing is cool. Let's get out of here faster. Kobe Cop, you're next. I'm afraid to go. You're next. Ooh, it's dark out there. Okay, I'm next. No, I won't go last. Come on, come on. Kobe Cop, you said it yourself. Come on, come on. Push me in! Uh, damn, you are heavy. Oh, it's so sticky. Uh, what is it? Call me a cough. It's so dirty. There's a mirror here, and on the mirror it says, what does the water hide? It's creepy. Everything's just covered in some kind of blood. Look, I see something. And how do we see it? We need to flush the water. <laughs> exactly. A t-shirt? 800 turns in 40 degrees. Oh, it's good that I can only do laundry in a Wait washing machine. Wait a minute. Maybe someone needs to take off his shirt? Look, a washing machine. It's closed. T-shirt mode. No, intense mode, 40 degrees, 800 turns. And on? It doesn't turn itself on. So it's open. Oh, guys. Oh my god. Oh, there's some sort of gopher hole. You're the only one who never went in first. It's your turn. No. Come on, do it. I was the first one. Now you go. I'm afraid, guys. Yeah, go. Go. Climb, climb. Go. Climb in or I'm going to kick you. I go next. Come on. Do you know what scares me most in this room? What are you saying? This cover right here. Whoa. Oh. What's that? There's someone standing there. Shoes, 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 shoes. Come on. Anyway, it says die here. Okay, guys, we have to move on. Why are you touching me? Quiet. Ah! Oh, 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 oh. It's just there shoes. Were just these shoes, and we, we, we got scared. Yeah. <laughs> For some reason, there are children's toys in coffins. Children's toys in here. A hint. A riddle. You need to compose a word. 
This is the letter A. A is usually at the end. Put A at the end. You need the letter I, and there will be a Maria. Maria. What? What is ah! that? Guys, no, Glenn. No, no, no. I no, won't Kobe go. Cough. No, uh. Oh, my shoes. Boys, will you give it to me? Give it to her. Come on. Give it to her. Come on, come on, come on. Hold on. No, you go. I don't have hands. Thank you. Now, let's play. Uh, okay, oh. well, we don't want to. I've already played. We've been playing all day today, and honestly, we want to kind of go outside to move on. Maybe you'd better tell us how we could get out of here. Get out? What for? I can't stand another 150 years without friends. No, play with me first. Yes, we don't want to play with you. Better tell me how we can get out of here. Well, you don't have to play, but then you will stay here with me forever. Okay, 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 okay. So let's play. Uh, what's the game? First... Guess my name. Masha, Maria. You need to figure it out. Let's check for more hints, guys. I found two letters, A and L. And I found you. Look at that creepy stuff here. <laughs> Hello. Oh. What letter? Z. So maybe that's enough? Oh, I figured it out. Maria. Let's go again. What are the options? Maria's Maria. her name, for sure. Louisa. Louisa Maria? That creepy dude from the oven said that. Exactly. Louisa Maria. Yes, that's right. My name is Louisa Maria. What about you? Uh, Vlad. Vlad. And I'm Vlad. Who, and who is that? What happened? Why are you scared? You're like little kids. This is his old, my doll. She's always crying. I want to calm her down. And then, perhaps, you will have a chance to get out. Kobe Cop, you get along with kids more. Come on, come on, Kobe Cop. You're not doing anything. Let me do that. I'll sing a lullaby. Do land, Kobe Cop. Hey, Dolly, 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 why are you crying? Quiet, 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 quiet. Don't say it. Do land, Kobe Cop. No, it doesn't work. It's battery powered. Oh, and what? Check this out. Hey, we calmed it down. Give me my doll. Well, you go. I would still, of course, play with you, but I have to go. See you later, boys. Although I don't think anyone else will see you. What? What do you mean no one will see? Who is that anyway? Guys, where's the exit? I don't get it. What the hell just happened now? I need more details. Louisa! Maria! Maria. Okay, let's move on and figure it out somehow. Glad. What? What if this board can be removed? I don't think so. Get away, get away, oh, get easy, away! Easy. Get away! Oh, 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 Louisa! She's gone. Well, maybe here's a way to leave this room. Guys, let's play rock, paper, scissors. Who's first? Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors. scissors. Oh, he's first. He's first. All right. Get it. Oh, there's that doll. You need no. it? Damn, guys. It's really weird. But one thing I know for sure. In order to hide from monsters, you need to cover yourself with the blanket. <laughs> Is that a fairy tale? It's not a fairy tale. Ugh, coward. Only garlic saves from monsters. Nice! Oh, that was nice. Garlic is for vampires, Vlad. Nothing saves you from monsters. And fist? Okay, who's next? Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors. scissors. You lost. What, me? Yeah. Now, welcome to hell, Vlad. <laughs> okay, okay, I lost. Ugh. Won't you cover yourself with the blanket? Why? I'd rather see what happens in the tunnel. Well, as you wish. Let's go! <laughs> Woohoo! So I was left alone. It's weird. Well, where's the bed? Hey! So, just in case, I'm gonna cover myself with the blanket. But if anything, I don't believe it. I believe it, I believe it! No. Damn, where are the boys? Guys! Oh, Glancing! Oh, oh, glad I am to see you! Kobe Cop, I'm so glad you're here. And where's Vlad? Did you eat him? <laughs> well, you're a joker. Okay, you better tell me why you've been gone for so long. Why is Vlad so late? Vlad was walking in front of me. <gasps> And he didn't cover himself with the blanket. Dude, it can't be. He must have got caught inside the tunnel. Damn, I knew it. This girl couldn't be trusted. I think it'd be good if it was a girl, but not a monster. I'm going back to Vlad. All right, let me help you. Come on. It doesn't work. Hey, send me back. Oh, oh. hello. No, no, guys, no, no. Who's that? Vlad, hello, is that you? Help me. Hung up. <gasps> to hear from you, guest of my cursed house. You don't have to know my name. More importantly, your friend won't come back to you, but you can always join him. What did you do to him? Hurry up and see for yourself. Just be attentive to the phones. Sometimes these devices are fraught with many secrets. If you decide to save a friend, call the phone at the end of the corridor. Call and the number. 
Well, what did he say? He didn't give the number. He just hung up. Ah! What's going ah! on? Ah! Ah! Oh. Oh, what's that? So this phone is at the end of the corridor. If anything, it'll call. So, what did he say after all? Be careful. There are all sorts of secrets hidden inside of phones. They hear everything or something like that. Inside the phones? All right, let's do this. Anything? Not visible yet. Oh, there's something. A note. Uh, check everything carefully. Another note. Call, oh. call. Number. What number? Ah, call the number. So let's keep hitting. What, what? Six, six, six. 23? Five, call. Five, two, three, six, six, six. Well, let's call. Maybe you. No. Well, okay, so. Call, five, two, three, six, six, six. Oh, so you decided to do this. Hurry up, because life has less and less time. But you have to understand, there's no way back, so go ahead, only forward. <gasps> the bedside table's <gasps> open, Kobe Cop. Come on, open it! He said only forward! So... Clint, come on, come get on, out! Let's go! Boys, where are you going? Take your time, I've baked a cake for you. <gasps> Wow, what is this? We're in an upside down room. Chandelier on the floor. Look at the table. And a, and a flower. Insane. And also, there's a door in here, just like the whole house. We gotta get out of here somehow. If we went through this really strange room, it's scary to think where Vlad is now. I agree, but wherever he is, we need to save him. And in order to do that, let's take a good look around here. Look, I found the coins. Apparently, the owner of the house collects them, and one is missing. And also, he likes to collect mirrors. Look, there are one, two, three, four of them here. Something has opened. Coins. Look! This is probably the coin that has been missing over there. Wow, uh, Kobe Cobb, how did you find this? Let's try it. That's it. <gasps> oh, everything's normal. So, well, turns out that this room is upside down. Then it's some kind of cellar. I don't think we should go there. It's not worth it. But there's no other choice. No one but us will save Vlad. Okay, Glenn, give me a lift. Okay, come on. Plenty. Oh, 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 oh. Thank goodness we're saved. And where's Vlad? Ah, ah, guys, guys, help me. Guys, help Vlad, me. Vlad, what are you doing? What is this? I laid down in this crib, you remember, without a blanket? Then it went dark, and just remember that I was tied up, and then I'm here. Oh, so man. tidy up. I don't know who did that. Probably the owner of the house was the one that called us. Dude, what if he's still around? Let's get out of here. Go, get go, out, go, get go, out, go. Get your legs out. Oh, man, that is so creepy. We need to get out of here as soon as possible. No, we can't leave this house just like that. It's moving. It's like it's alive. And then suddenly, one of our subscribers will get stuck in there. Subscribers? I, I need fire. You're going to set it on fire? Of course. So... Oh, oh, there's still some fire left. Okay, come on. Okay, we put That's the fire out. It. Oh, man. That's it. Our subscribers are safe, and no one else will get into this house. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was a bit creepy. Don't you agree? <laughs> if you liked it, hit that like button. Well, I was with you. My name is Vlad A4. Gulen Cubby Cup. Bye. Bye, everyone. Gulen Cubby Cup. Gulen. Vlad A4. Gulen Cubby Cup. Gulen. Vlad A4. And all of you forgot how I fly in my Lambo. <laughs>